Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of We Review It, where we take a look at products we want to try and things that we actually use. Today, I've got this full face snorkel made by Crane for Aldi. I'm having a lot of fun out here, but it does have a few issues. Let's get to that in a minute. First, let's put it together. Today, we've got this crane mask that we found in Aldi. It's one of these snorkeling masks that uh, covers your entire face. So we're gonna try this out. Okay, well that's pretty simple. It pretty much just pops out of the packaging and it's ready to go, but I think we need to adjust these straps. You take this little thing and you put it over that and then you pull it tight. It makes a seal with an O-ring. You always gotta worry about these O-rings when it comes to anything water, cause they're the things that will get compressed and go bad. It does come with this little doodad. It's for attaching your action camera to it. Luckily, I did bring my GoPros today, but we've reached our first snag in this thing. To put the action camera thing on, you gotta take the straps off. I'm not big on instructions, but this is affixing the action camera bracket. To attach the action camera to the snorkeling mask, you must affix the supplied bracket. Loosen the mask strap from the openings on the front of the snorkeling mask. Well, at least for having uh, instructions, at least they are written in English and pretty easy to understand. We've got our dive master Fabio here working on this stuff. He's a uh, certified scuba dive master, so. Fabio, what do you think of this thing? That's wonderful. <laughs> would you ever use one? No. Why would you never use one? Well, no, it's not so bad. It's actually flat. Why would you never use one? Like? Well, this one would be okay because of visibility. Okay. But uh, you, see this? you said other ones are like a dome? Yeah, this isn't a dome, it's a flat, so it looks like a scuba mask. You're not going to get claustrophobia. Mm. How do you pinch your nose to... You can't. Yeah. So you can't dive down. Uh, I just noticed this is not round, no. Let's put the GoPro on and then let's see yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of how this thing works out. What did you say? There's a section on disposing of the mask. <laughs> Why would they include that on there? <laughs> is that for when you want to throw it away when it's not good? <laughs> okay, so... Unfortunately, their action camera mount doesn't come with one of these, which, you know, isn't uncommon. But it also doesn't come with the little nut to put that in. So, thankfully I have one thing with me now that, that does have that. Well, when it comes to mounting an action camera on this thing, already we've ran into a snag. These don't go through with the camera, so you're just relying on friction to hold your uh, GoPro on there. And if you're gonna do that, well, it's only for on our for, for the swimming pool, it's okay, oh. but for the ocean, we can put a little uh, do MacGyver and put a little tie. Oh, and MacGyver, okay. MacGyver, it, and then I'll Fabio's gonna MacGyver it. Brought it. I'm gonna put one of these little guys on there. So, um, we got the GoPro in on there, but only after wire tying it. So it's already a couple of negative points on this thing. Okay. I'm honestly a little scared to use this thing in the water now. I mean, if this GoPro thing is this bad, how bad is the rest of it? Oh, glad I'm the guinea pig, not the kids. I feel like I'm in Stranger Things in a hazmat suit or something. Okay, so I I am wearing the mask. It, it does seem to seal up pretty good on my face, so that's a plus, but uh, we're gonna go try it in. Oh gosh, it's cold. All right, here we go. <laughs> All right, well, that is the full face snorkel by Aldi. It's not bad. It's actually pretty fun. And for about around $20, it really is a cool toy to have. I actually like using it quite a bit, but would I use it in the ocean? Probably not. There's probably similar ones that work a lot better when it comes to ocean, but uh, you know, it is your life that may depend on it. Fabio, would you trust this in the ocean? No. Why not? too dangerous you can't get it off in time and uh, you can if a wave comes over you don't have control of it mm -hmm. for $20 though it's not much more than a regular toy yeah. face mask and snorkel combination and it works a lot better than those one of the issues I've had with these is water intrusion where water comes into your eyes and nose and fogging up and that is something that the full face mask actually does really well. It holds onto your face really tight, not uncomfortably tight, but just enough to not let any water in. 
it did let some in, but that was when I dove down. So something with the valves going under and the pressure caused water to come in. But you probably don't want to be diving down anyways. It was good enough with the water intrusion that I was comfortable putting my wireless microphone inside of the mask. So hopefully you guys could hear me there. But yeah, when it comes to the action camera mount, that is where I have the biggest issue. And that guy just does not work very well. So you saw we had to wire tie it on. Yeah, I would just skip on the action camera part altogether and just hold it in your hand like I'm doing with this guy. And um, what else are you gonna do with your hands underwater anyways, right? All right, well, that's the end of our video. But hey, if you like it, give it a big thumbs up and let me know what you think by commenting below. And if you feel like it, check out some of these videos. I think you might like them. All right, guys, I'm going to get back to swimming. So I'll see you on the next one.